Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, if it's your first time here, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much, welcome back. I have today to share with you, it's been sitting here over a week, my Knowles Farm August pre-order. And um, yeah, it's been sitting here now for like 10 days. So I wanted to show you guys what I got and then get it all put away. Um, Travis is the owner of Knowles Farms, very active on Facebook. And excuse me that I do not know his wife's name. I have i don't remember what his wife's name is, but it's Travis and his wife. Um, so this is like my third order with Knowles. Everything I wore, I absolutely have been loving his wax. I have to tell you, when I smell it on cold, it's so much better on warm. And, um, yeah, I'm really happy with, with everything so far that I have warmed of his. I'm loving. So let me get going because I have a couple other videos I want to do this weekend um, because next week I have a busy work week. So this is a sample of Autumn on the Farm. And he puts poor dates, which I love. Autumn on the Farm is pumpkin, cinnamon, clove, fir, and cedarwood. And I opened the box with Alexis this past weekend. So we did sniff through everything. Oh, this is so good. It has a little smoky scent. It must be the cedar wood. Oh, this is so good. So this was my sample. I got two nice pieces. So that's a great nighttime bedroom melt in my room for two warmers. Then he sent me a sample of his body cream. I didn't know he did body cream in beach evenings, which is one of a, ve it's a very popular scent of his. Then I was watching um, Christine this morning. I was watching her Knowles video and she got his, um, it's called pecan pumpkin waffles, not pumpkin pecan waffles. I think pecan pumpkin waffles, the candle, she loves it. She has backups of it, and um, she was telling everybody, like, you have to try this candle. So from watching her this morning, she said he's going to do an RTS if he has that candle, because that's one of my favorite um, scents is pumpkin pecan waffles in the fall and winter. If he has that candle, I'm going to definitely grab it. Wasn't planning on ordering from the RTS. I might just grab that candle because I honestly don't need any more wax. So he does body cream and it's beach evenings. Yeah, it's so good. I got to put a little, my hands are a little dry. Oh, it's beautiful. Wow. Very nice. So this is his body lotion. Thank you so much, Travis. This was so kind of you to send me this. Like, it's not like it's a little sample of the cream. Like, that is a really nice size, and I really appreciate it. Thank you. I'm going to start with brittles. That's what I got the most of. I only got, th I got three loaves. Yeah, three loaves, and the rest I got brittles. Look how pretty those colors look. So, the brittles are $7.75 each. And um, I got Cozy Evenings poured August 30th. So it's not even a month old yet. So I do let his wax sit and cure. I let everyone's wax sit and cure because I always try to use up the oldest. Like I still have wax of his from his, I think he had an RTS I participated in last. So I still have some from there. But now I'm going to start really going heavy warming his um, knolls. So Cozy Evenings is Leaves, Beach Evenings, and Comfort. God, these colors are so beautiful. Oh, this is gorgeous. How pretty. Yum. Okay, next is Campfire Confection Poured August 10th. Sugar cookie dough bread and campfire marshmallow. Now, I did watch, um, Travis did a live. 
mm -hmm. with all the girls. And I think they did it on Christine's channel. So I tuned into that and that really made me add stuff to my list. When I watch the lives that the girls do with the vendor on as a guest, of course I'm adding to my list. So Campfire Confection, this is right up my alley anyway. Anything that says Campfire, I'm in. This is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. What This is the sugar cookie dough bread. I love bread scents. Oh, oh, I thought I got to say, wait, I got two cozy evenings. No, this is beach evenings. So I also got the beach evenings that he sent me, the body cream in the brittle. How pretty this brittle, these colors are. I know I keep saying that. But this is gorgeous. This is something that's like a fan favorite is his beach evenings. Like every vendor seems to have like their thing that people really love that specific one. And um, it seems for Travis, his beach evenings is really a hit with everybody. Look how pretty that is. Oh, this smells so good. And I feel like. I feel like I have beach evenings in my drawer. So now what I do is I don't put these away. I double bag them. I put them back in the box and then I mark it August 24 pre-order because I won't start warming these till I get through. I still have from last year fall. I think the first time I ordered with Travis was in November last year. So I want to get through at least make a big dent on those until I can start hitting these up. Fireplace Cuddles. I grabbed two of these. Chestnut, Smoky Woods, Vanilla, Berries, and Orange Blossom. Yum. This is so, so, so good. Like, I don't feel like I need to buy any wax for a long time because I have so much wax right now, and then I have some other pre-orders sitting here to do. So I'm definitely on a, I'm, I'm on a, um, I don't like to say no buy, because whenever anyone says no buy and then they do videos, I'm on an absolute low buy. Um, I have a few other, like I said, pre-orders coming in, but I will not be participating in the rest, for the rest of the year. I will grab that candle though, if he offers it. So two fireplace cuddles. I'm so happy I grabbed two. Wonderland Whimsy. Wonderland Whimsy was, I had this before, but it had another name, Mad About You, I think. Mad About, Mad About You. And then he, for whatever reason, he changed the name. Wonderland Whimsy poured August 22nd. Almond macaron, vanilla cupcake, vanilla icing, and lavender tea. I love this so much. So this is one where, so this is a brittle. This is one where I'll just do it in like my kitchen in the morning or at night in my room. Like this, I wouldn't do, like use this whole, like this will get me a bunch of warms. Let's put it that way. I'll do it in my room at night and like two of my warmers would be enough because this is strong. Yeah, this is, I would take this in a loaf. Like if it wasn't that I had so much wax, I remember the day of ordering, I was really back and forth with myself because I wanted a loaf, but I had to talk sense into myself that I have so much wax right now. So I grabbed the brittle because I know Travis will bring it back. Like I know he might not bring it back like anymore this year in 24, but I know by spring he'll bring it back again. And I would definitely take this in a loaf. That's how much I love it. Actually, when I warmed it, when it was the mad, mad about tea, I see it in my brain. Mad about tea or mad about you? Mad about, let's say mad about tea. The day I warmed it last, like back in the winter, last winter, I took a picture and I put it on his uh, Facebook page. Been there, dunked that. It's espresso yourself, almond macaroon, and pretzel. And I grabbed two of these. <sighs> P 
pretzel with coffee is one of my favorite and it's espresso with pretzel. I love espresso with pretzel. Look how pretty that is. Semper is snoring, just so you know if you hear it in the background. That's Semper snoring. Okay, Velvet Dawn. I believe this is one that was not on my list. And while I was watching the live, Travis, there were uh, there was two that I added to my list because Travis said they were his favorites. When somebody asked him, what are your favorites on your list? And this one and the next one I'm going to do were the ones he chose as his favorites on the list. And this is Jasmine, Saffron, Fir, F-I-R, Cedar, and Amber. So the Jasmine is kind of probably why I, I didn't have it on my list. And I'm so happy I got it. It's so good. Mm, that is good. Okay, the next one, I think this was the first one he said was his favorite. And then I think he second guessed himself or something. And then he said the Velvet Dawn one too. So that's what made me put them both on my list. This is Lemon Cream Crumble. It's fresh lemon, graham cracker crust, sugar, brown sugar, heavy cream, and powdered sugar poured August 25th. I love lemon scents, especially when I'm like a day that I'm house cleaning. I like to warm either like a fresh, like a beachy ocean air, a salty sea air when I'm cleaning or a lemon. Those are the two I go, I reach for. So this was one of his favorites on his list, he said. And I could, this is, this is, I would take this in a loaf. The next time he offers this, I'm taking a loaf in it. It is beautiful. Okay, guys, next I got three loaves. And the loaves are, I think, I lost my sheet. Oh, here we are. $20.25. Hello, it's me. Hello, it's me, Fall. Apple cider, donut, Palo Santo, toasted marshmallow, poured August 31st. So this is Hello, It's Me, Fall. I love that name. And it's so freaking good. Oh, it's got all over me. Guys, did anybody get this one? Let me know if you participated in what you ordered, please. Comment below. I want to know what everybody got. Did you get any of the ones I got? What did I miss? What What's your favorite of what you got? I want to know. Okay, this is phenomenal. This this is like so, so, so good. Next, I bet you think about me. It's Cali Coffee Bar, Sugar Cookie Dough Bread, and Palo Santo. Now, I grabbed this in a loaf. This was poured August 21st. And I don't know what made me grab it in a loaf because I have two jaws full of coffee. And I pro told myself, no more coffee till I make a big dent and get it to one draw. And I ordered this in a loaf. So there had to be somebody saying something in the chat that night. There had to be something said about this blend that I just, I was like, I need it in a loaf. Not caring that I have two draws full of coffee. So this is Cali Coffee Bar, Sugar Cookie Dough Bread, and Palo Santo. I, I know I'm not gonna regret that I grabbed it in a loaf. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. This is so, so, so good. Oh, I can't wait to warm this. I'm so happy I got it in a loaf. Okay. Next, this is a repeat for me. I actually been working on mine. I started it last fall and then I put it away because I didn't want to use the rest. It was so good. So I've been hoarding it. And all I've had in my mind now since I got, got this order is I can now finish my loaf from November because I grabbed this in a loaf too last November. It's his pumpkin pie pound cake. Guys, this is the best pumpkin pie pound cake I've ever had. And I'm not just saying that. This is the best I've ever had. 
and it is vanilla pound cake, pumpkin souffle, and pumpkin pie. Now, the one I have from last year is uh, more this color from the Hello, It's Me Fall. Now, this one is green. I don't care, I'm just saying. And this, this is just too good to be true. Like, it's so good. I love this so much. I app that's the end of my order. I absolutely love everything I got. If you were to say, what are my standouts? I'm gonna tell you right now, forget the pumpkin pie pound cake is a repeat for me, so I'm not gonna include that. You know I love that. I didn't put them back in the bag yet. I try not, not to do the crinkling. Hello, it's me, fall. Absolutely love it. And the lemon cream crumble. I want this in a loaf. I love everything so much. Travis, thank you so, so much. I love everything. I'm so happy with your wax. If you do offer that pecan pumpkin waffle candle, I have to get it because um, Christine said, said I do. She told all of us you have to get the candle. So if she loves it that much, I'm like, okay, I have to have it because that's my favorite. And um, so that's it, everybody. Everybody, love you guys. Have a great week. And maybe you'll, I'll see you back here. I have a couple other videos to do. Bye.